Hi, my name's Brian Mace. I'm a product manager for Lincoln Electric's PowerWave products. Today I want to share with you some information about how to diagnose machine faults and how to collect a snapshot file to help troubleshoot the machine with Lincoln Electric's customer service department. Right now I'm standing in front of a PowerWave 300C where we have simulated a thermal shutdown fault. You can see here on the screen that we have a system thermal shutdown. And if we have any other types of faults, they will show in this same screen. You can then take this information and share it with the Lincoln Electric Customer Service Department, or you can send them the snapshot file that can be saved via a USB drive or through PowerWave Manager. Let's walk over to an R450 PowerWave and I'll show you how to read the LED blink codes out of that machine. Over here on the R450, we have to rely on LED blink codes to understand what the error or fault code is. So down here on the bottom, we see the status LED is blinking red. When it blinks green, that resets the code, and then we start to count the blinks after that. Typically, it's a two or a three digit fault code. So let's wait for the green light. Here we go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six. So that is error code number 446. We can now walk over to PowerWave Manager on our computer, type that error in to understand what it means. This style of blinking fault code applies to the PowerWave R450, S500, and S700 platform. Let's walk over to the laptop and type the code in to understand what this fault means. To understand the fault codes and to collect a snapshot through PowerWave Manager, you're going to start the PowerWave Manager application on your computer and connect to the machine. If the machine has an active fault code, you're going to see that on the home screen of PowerWave Manager. And we can see that the latest events are here. So this is error 446, cooler object not found. And this is a latched error. We can also look up an error manually from the LED blink codes that I shared previously. So if I know that my error code is 446, I can type that in and look it up and it will give me some information around it. Now, to save a snapshot for the customer service group, you're gonna come down under Tools and click Snapshot, and simply say, select Save Snapshot and save that file. Now, this will take approximately a minute uh, to collect the snapshot file and save it. And then you can email that to your technical sales representative or the customer service department. If you have a machine with an active fault code and you have questions on it, be sure to reach out to Lincoln Electric's customer service. For more information on the PowerWave platform, visit lincolnelectric.com.